Hello guys, welcome to my today's video. In this video, I'm going to talk about uh, this Ukraine website, pp.ua, which is providing free domain service for personal usage. I was looking for a domain for my lab environment, and then I found this, which is perfect for me. Um, let's start it. Basically, domains in pp.ua is free for use, and in general function, there's no other difference from other domains. Uh, there's uh, accredited uh, registrars here. Usually, I come and go to nick.ua, which is coming from same country, Ukraine. I already registered some for myself, but if you really need to do it, just register account for yourself and then you can start work on. Look here in the domains page, it shows this is free. You just need to click register domain and then you can go to this registration page. So there's uh, some requirements to register domain three, minimum number or symbols. Maximum is 63 numbers of uh, characters. Who is server? Of course, it's public. It's not private. You cannot hide your registration information. And also, uh, there's some other limitations. For each phone number, you only can register three at the most in one month. So one phone number, just um, three subdomains on the pp.ua for a month. If you have to do more, then you have to wait another month to do that. The domains need to be activated. I'm going to show you how to activate once you register your domain. So first thing, let's uh, find the domain. I'm trying to see the sec. It shouldn't be used anywhere. Yeah, so it's free. Then you add to the cart. Just check out, continue. So here's um, my personal information. It's going to be shows out. You cannot be hiding that information. So then it's ready. So you go to the dashboard, then you will see the domains. So let's sec the pp.ua. It's in the process. It's not been activated. When you see this grid icon here, that means it's not been activated yet. And uh, if it's been activated, you will see this green dot is active, just like I show you here. So for the activation, then you have to go to pp.ua website. Um, ideally, once your registration is completed, then you will get the SMS code through uh, the cell phone, and then you will get a SMS code, and then you can activate it here. I tried my phone number. It doesn't work. I waited um, many days, but uh, the code never comes. Uh, eventually, I found another way, which is using Telegram this program to activate it. Here is a pp.ua domains restriction. You can find from nick.ua website from the knowledge base. And you also can see this activate pp.ua domain documentation as well. So once you received activation key from SMS, then you can use uh, this activation form to do that. Unfortunately, my phone number never get the key. So then we have to find uh, Telegram to do this. So I found it much easier. So here is the Telegram screen, the operation process to activate this domain.
So we got the code from Telegram. Now next step, we're going to activate it through this activation form. So in this lab, I'm going to use IT plus SAC as an example. Unfortunately, I cannot use in NASAC, which is the fourth one under my account. So I'm going to activate itprosec.pp.ua and the phone number. I can just um, put my phone number in there. And here is the key I got uh, from Telegram. And make sure you are not a robot here. And continue. Uh, the phone number has to be in right format. So I'm gonna type the key again. So now we can see the domain ID .ua activated and ready to use. You also can go back to the dashboard here. You can create in the name servers. So I created one before, now we can create a new one or the new server. This is uh, free from nick.ua website but only free for three months so if you just temporarily testing it you can order a free one and go to my orders and then you should be able to see the domain server is available you can enable auto renew Go back here. Right away, after you activated your domains, itprotect.pp.ua becomes green. Perfect. So one thing also I like to do is using a Cloudflare to manage my domain. So, so let's uh, go back to the Cloudflare website. Um, I previously, I added a 51 sec to pp.ua in here. Um, actually, we can do more. We can add a new website, itprosec.pp.ua in here. You may not find in your website at this moment because it has to be broadcast well. Oh, it's working. Let's go. To, I'm choosing free plan. So it's just free scanning for existing DNS record. Sometimes when you just register your domain, you have to wait a um, couple hours to get the domain to broadcasting over the world. Cloudflare can grab it from other registrar and then get those information for you as I did here. So now we are good and then there's two things we need to do. We need to log into our register account and change it, remove those two domain name server and then change it to those two. So that uh, we're gonna do it. ID domain server pp.ua we're gonna go to the configuration page this uh, NS server, we're using Parketed name server, which is nick.ua name server. We gonna do custom name servers, so we're gonna change it. Just copy both of them and replace, just replace those Parketed name servers. Save.
go back to Cloudflare and uh, let's say dumb check name servers get started um, you can activate or to HTTPS redirection always using HTTPS I don't want to change any settings right now just keep the default settings So itprotect.pp.ua is still pending DNS service changes. So we can click check name service here to initialize the name server check now. It may take a couple of minutes to get it done or maybe a couple of hours as here based on the web page says. Um, we will come back to check it again after a few hours. There's one testing we can do is we can use as lookup to check those domains. You activate it. For example, uh, previously I activated my 51 sec, so you will get that name resolution. Um, we can test it ID Pro sec as well. So as you can see, it cannot be resolved. So that means this dom new domain hasn't been broadcast into the world yet. We will come back once we have checked it out correctly. After a couple of hours, I'm checking this again. Overview. Okay, it's become active now. As you can see, itprosec.pp.ua has been active. So we can create in a DNS record here. Uh, those records are found from the old register. We can add a new one. Test the one, we're gonna put it onto 808808. After this step, we can make a quick testing here. 51 is fine, and we're gonna do no internal typos. So let's say test one dot id plus sec So now we got the IP. This is a Cloudflare IP. Uh, basically, Cloudflare as a proxy to reply back a Cloudflare's IP when you query test one, this A record. So that's all the settings to get your new pp.ua domain integrated with your Cloudflare. Thank you for watching.